My name is Mark Corradetti and I'm an electric bass player. I've been playing bass about 40 years, um, give or take, 38 years. I believe I started in 1980 when I was a freshman in high school. I went to Berklee College of Music in 1984. I had some, some great teachers and there were tons of great players and it was just awesome. I mean, we just played and learned and I mean, 24 seven, seven days a week. I mean, it was just, it was just great. I uh, moved to Nashville from New Jersey in 1994 and I was there until uh, 2015 when we decided to move to California. I had a great uh, um, a time in Nashville. It was a great place to live. There were terrific musicians, lots of projects. Uh, for me, um, moving here was a, was a good choice because of, uh, there was more diversity here for me and um, you know, the weather's better. Typical day in my life would be I you know, get up early about five in the morning and normally practice for a couple of hours early on. Um, then I get into uh, um, correspondence with uh, some of the artists from around the world that I work in. You know, they'll send me tracks that I play with. You know, from countries like uh, um, you know South Korea, Japan, Sweden, Germany, Australia, and here in the states. And then hopefully I'll have some you know local things I have to do. So I have a pretty full day almost every day. It's so important to walk in with a great attitude and, uh, and, and you want that to come back. And uh, when it does, then the music just works out. It really doesn't matter to me what, what it is. I mean, as long as all the musicians, you know, want to have a good product and they're really passionate about it is what, what drives me the most. I've always said that uh, um, they call it playing music for a reason. It's not supposed to be work. It's supposed to be fun. And I think the more you experience life, the better your music becomes. Because um, you have to live life. That's what it's all about. It's like a flower. You put water on it. It grows. A great teacher of mine taught me that. And he was right. You know, like 30 years later, you, you kind of realize that. So if you're not living life, you're not really... Uh, um, Playing, you're not you're not really doing it you have to live life too it's important music has always been and will continue to be in uh, my own personal space my own enclave you know when I'm happy it's there when I'm sad it's there I can express myself and that's the most glorious part of it you know some say it's a gift but uh, um, you know I'm just running with it and uh, yeah, my mother certainly thought so. So, there you go. <laughs>